I wanted to be a teacher more or less since I was little. I loved being able to see the joy in a kid's eyes when it learned something that it had been fighting with for ages. I do love music. I usually play the trumpet after everybody else is in bed and playing for them. And what, 84 years? This one night it was extremely foggy. I got the call to come up. They had a problem. The three aircraft were lost. The boss of the radar sack said, there's no way we're going to find them. I said, oh yeah, we'll find them. Make a long story short, brought all aircraft in, landed with no incident, made my reputation. Oh yeah, I was 73 when I went back to high school. It was something that I wanted to do, to say that I accomplished something, I, that I graduated. Show the uh, seniors that you can accomplish something if you want. We were on the beach. That's where I first learned war had started. Every night, you know, he broke his sleep. He just felt he couldn't do it anymore. And as we were rushed down to the shelters, my aunt said, one more look at her home and say, do you think that's going to be there when we come back again? When I came to Trenton, I found an opportunity to assist youth in town. We contribute to 18 organizations on an annual basis here in town. I can honestly say I, I've never worked or done anything that I hated doing. I, I've enjoyed everything I've done. I think I was just fortunate. It's just about everything in town I belong to one time or another. I like people and I like to help people. It's, it's a reason to be alive. If they're being downtrodden or they're being badly treated, you stand up for others if there's nobody else doing it. If you can, you do. I think that the best advice I can give is uh, to be true to yourself and to be honest and to work hard and to help other people.